Hello friends. Till now we have covered chapter 1, chapter 2 and chapter 3 of class 2 NSO that Science Olympiad workbook 2023. And today we are going to discuss and learn about chapter 4 that is food. What are the things that may be asked out of this chapter? That could be food sources whether it's from plants or animals. kinds of foods such as energy giving body building and protective foods one then what is balanced diet healthy eating habits keeping our teeth healthy etc let's see food helps us to stay alive to grow and be healthy we get food from plants for example rice wheat etc and animals for example milk meat eggs etc salt is an important part of our food that is obtained neither from plants nor from animals we get it from sea water people who eat meat eggs etc are called non vegetarians and those who do not eat them and eat plant based food are called vegetarians the food we eat can be put into different groups now let's see one is energy giving food like food that gives us energy to work play and do other activities for example cereals oil bread etc then next one is body building food that makes our muscles strong food that helps us to grow and build up our bones and muscles and those are eggs meat milk etc then comes your protective food food that helps us to stay healthy and fight against diseases and we have fruits and vegetables in this category let's check out some healthy eating habits do's and don'ts first we'll see do's what should we do to stay healthy eat meals at the proper time eat clean fresh food in a clean plate wash your hands before and after eating rinse your mouth after eating chew your food well with your mouth closed and eat a healthy and balanced meal now let's see some don'ts eat too much or too little food no eat with dirty hands no no eat dirty and stale food no always eat junk food never eat while reading a book or watching tv no so what is a balanced diet Balanced diet is a diet that contains all the type of food in the exact right amount. We should have our meals at a fixed time every day. We have breakfast in the morning, lunch in the afternoon, snacks in the evening and dinner at night. And we should keep our teeth clean. We should at least brush our teeth twice a day. With this we have seen and covered and understood what was the theoretical portion of this chapter 4 now we'll do some questions some practical questions let's see question 1 which of these is commonly used in india for making beverages what are beverages these are drinks let's see the a a is mango b use mango mango is used for making aam panna then is lemon lemon is also used for making lemonade and then is tree Tea leaves are used for making tea. So the right answer is option D. All of these, all of these are used in India for making beverages. Question two: Which of the following should we avoid? A. Drinking uh, milk or water, which is perfectly okay. B. Eating your apple, that is also good. And uh, what is C here? C seems to be uncovered food items from roadside vendors which is not okay we should avoid that because flies sit on them and make them unhygienic eating such foods can make us sick so C is the option which we should avoid question 3 food like sugar and bread are dash food we learned about it few minutes back right they are energy giving food option A is the right answer Question 4 select the odd one out on the basis of food group to which they belong here egg fish and chicken they are body building food whereas bread is an energy giving food so for us option 
D is the right answer. Select the food item that belongs to the same food group to which the item shown in the picture belongs. And what is that item? That is fish. And fish is a bodybuilding food. Now, among A, B, C, D, egg is a bodybuilding food. Because A is the right answer. It is the same category of fish. Let's see others. Cabbage, cabbage and then C is spinach. These two are protective food. Last one is butter, which is an energy giving food. So the right answer is option A, eggs. Question 6. Select the food item that is good for our health. Now here, there is some coke, we have egg, we have fries and burgers. So A, C, D, they are junk foods. And B is a healthy food. Option B is the right answer. Question 7. The items shown in the box are, let's see the items, what do we have? We have ghee, we have oil, potatoes, chapati, rice. And what are these? These are energy giving food. Option A is the right answer. Question 8. Select the incorrect match. Let's see. Sugar, plant, honey, insect, salt, animal and cocoa, plant. Now here sugar plant is correct because sugar is derived from sugar cane. Honey is coming from honeybee that is also correct salt we learned about it right it is neither plant based nor any animal based we get that from sea water so option c is incorrect over here and cocoa we get from cocoa plant okay let's see question nine which of these is a healthy diet oh it looks like i'm sitting in a restaurant and then there are four menus let's see which one will you choose as a healthy diet Option A has chocolate, milkshake, cheeseburger. Doesn't look like that much healthy. Option 2 is tomato soup, pea pulao and curd. Hmm, yummy and healthy. So B is the right option. Let's see C and D also. Potato chips and porridge, not healthy. And pizza and cheese toast, not healthy. So the healthiest diet out of these four is option B. Question 10. Jivika eats too many chocolates and sweets every day. This can cause cavities in her. Now, this is something which your parents must be telling you almost all the time and making you brush your teeth also. And that is why? Because it creates cavities in teeth. So, the right answer is option C, teeth. Question 11. Select the incorrect option of do's and don'ts. Let's see, A, drink water after proper purification, do's. That's correct. Then eat uncovered food, don't. That is correct. So option A is correct. Let's see option B, wash hands before and after meals, correct. Don't talk while eating, correct. Option B is also correct. C, eat junk food, no. Don't eat food at regular intervals every day, no. So we got our incorrect option that is option C. Question 12. Match column 1 and column 2 and select the correct option. Column 1 A is dry fruit. So what is a dry fruit? Out of options in column 2 I can see raisin and I can see almond. So these are the two types of dry fruits. Then we have B which is pulses. Out of these, which one is pulses? It is green gram. So B matches 1, A matches 2 and 6, B matches 1. Then comes C, beverage, the liquid I was talking about. Coffee and tea are the right one for that. So C matches 3 and 5. D is a spice and we have coriander. D matches 4. Right option is option C. A matches 2, 6. B matches 1. C matches 3, 5 and D matches 4. Question 13. The given picture shows that Ali is most likely eating his. Now closely see the picture. In picture we can see the time is 1 o'clock, 1 p.m. And sun can also be seen shining through the window. So it is afternoon, right? After 12. So what meal is there in afternoon? It is lunch. Ali is eating his lunch. Option B, lunch is the right answer. Question 14. 
we should not skip x meal because body requires it the most after hours of gap between meal what is x so what is the longest gap in our day between our meals it is between dinner and breakfast because after dinner we sleep we sleep at least for 7 to 8 hours after that we wake up we do our hygiene things and then eat breakfast so breakfast is very important for our body option d breakfast is the right answer question 15 kritika i am fond of sports and would like to become a sports person when i grow up what should kritika include in her diet to develop strong muscles required for being a sports person let's see out of all these things the right option is option b why because fish eggs and pulses are body building foods therefore they will help kritika to develop strong muscles required for being a sports person moving to the achiever section hots question 16 study the given classification chart and select the option which can fill the empty spaces d e and f correctly so we study types of food right the same table is here energy giving food then body building food and then protective food so d is energy giving food and e is body building food and f is protective food so the right match here looks like option b because rice that is d is energy giving food egg that is e is body building food and then f fruits is protective food so b is the right option question 17 study the given relationship based on the type of food group and select the option that satisfies the same type of relationship so in the given relationship fish bread and carrot are body building uh, and energy giving and protective food respectively so first one fish that is body building bread is energy giving and your last one carrot is protective food so same way we have to find the sequence which option is matching this sequence the right answer again is option b because egg here is a body building then rice is energy giving and then your spinach is your protective food question 18 three groups of food are shown below which of these groups helps us to grow and prevent us from falling sick respectively and then gives us the most energy and is roughage rich food respectively so let's see the plates and understand what food groups they belong to so food group l that is fish milk egg and dal they are body building food then m which is sugar rice butter and bread they are energy giving food and then comes n fruit and vegetables they are protective food let's see for uh, a what should be the right plates help us to grow what will help us to grow it is body building food that means l and the second part of that sentence is prevent us from falling sick so we have to find the protective food and that is in plate n so for a l and n are the correct plates which is that option which contains l and n as a that is option c now let's see the sentence b gives us the most energy which one is the energy giving plate it is m and is roughage rich food respectively which one is that that is our protective food n so for statement b it should be m and n so the right option here is option c which has a l and n and b m and n question 19 refer to the given flow chart and select the incorrect option regarding it let's see the flow chart food obtained from animals if no then q if yes is it considered as vegetarian if yes r if no p statement a there is no such food item as r let's see what is r r is the food that is obtained from animal and it is also considered as vegeta uh, vegetarian uh, this statement looks incorrect because there are food which uh, belongs to the category of r now which are those foods milk butter cheese they all come come from animal but they are considered as vegetarian food because their production does not involve killing any animal so we already got our answer the incorrect statement here is option a there is no such food item as r where is whereas there are items which are from animals and considered as vegetarian question 20 
Refer to the given table. Identify food items P, Q, and R and select the correct option. Let's see what is P. It is productive food, but not obtained from plant, not obtained from animal. Q is obtained from plant and is a productive food. R is obtained from animal. Let's see option A. P could be spinach. Hmm. Spinach. It is not possible because under P it is written it is not obtained from plant, whereas spinach is obtained from plant. So A is not right option. Option B is Q could be orange. You know what is Q? Q is obtained from plant. Yes, orange is obtained from plant, and Q is a protective food. Absolutely correct because orange is a fruit. So that portion is correct. Whereas R could be cottage cheese, and R is obtained from plant, uh, from animal. And R is cottage cheese in option B that is obtained from animal. So option B is the correct option for us. And with that we have studied chapter four that is food from our class two and so workbook 2023. Do like the video and share the channel with your friends and family. Subscribe it if you have not yet done. We will be uploading other chapters also very soon. So keep watching. Happy learning.